Elise is being followed through in Paris by French police who is working with Scotland Yard under the direction of Inspector John. He has spent years hunting Alexander Pierce, Elise's lover, who owes 744 million taxes and is believed to have received plastic surgery to alter his appearance, so no one knows what he's looked like. He's also being hunted by Reginald Chow, a mobster. Pierce stole 2.3 billion from him. At Paris, Elise received written instruction from Pierce to board the train to Venice. Board the 822 at the Gare de Lyon. Pick someone my height and build and make them believe it is me. She burns a note, escape the police, and boards the train. On the train, Elise selected Frank Tupelo. I'm sorry. What for? A mathematic teacher from a community college in Wisconsin. Jean collected information about the blame from the remaining bird note and knew her location. A policeman in Cho's payroll alerts him that Pierce is on the train to Venice with Elise and shows immediately changed course to Venice. She invites Frank to stay with her at the hotel, where she received instructions from Pierce to attend the ball. She abandoned Frank. La signora ordered it for you when she left. When she left. Who was then chased by Shaw's man. <laughs> While trying to escape, he is detained by Italian police and a corrupted inspector attempts to turn him over to Shaw's man for a bounty. You've come to buy a key? She rescues him just before he is handed over. Shaw's men chase them until they finally escape. She leaves Frank at the airport with his passport and money, urging him to go home for his own safety. I wish we'd met in another life, Frank. She goes to see John, who has come to Venice and is revealed to be an undercover Scotland Yard agent who was under suspension for her suspected sympathies with Pierce. She agrees to participate in a sting operation to bring Pierce to justice. While she's trying to find Pierce at the pole, a man plays an envelope on her table and disappears into the crowd. Wait! Alexander! Excuse me. It's Pierce. He's here. He just left that envelope. Pull up the footage. We have his face. She tries to follow him, but she is stopped by Frank, who claims to be in love with her and invites her to dance. The police arrive and take Frank into protective custody. She read the note, leaving her boat, tailed by Show and the police. When she gets to the house which Pierce's note directed her, Show take her hostage, threatening to harm her unless she reveals the location of the hidden safe where Pierce is keeping the stolen money. The police monitors the situation from outside and John repeatedly refused to allow Italian police snipers to intervene to rescue Elise. I have to do something. Permission to fire. Hold your fire, I repeat, hold your fire, not until Pierce shows himself. While the police are distracting, monitoring the situation, Frank escapes and confronts Joe, claims to be Pierce. Is it you? Truly? And offering to open the safe if Elise is allowed to leave. Show still friend to open the safe or he will torture Lise. Chief Inspector Jones arrive, override Joan and order the sniper to fire. This is Chief Inspector Jones. Permission granted. Fire. <laughs> Killing Show and his men. Then he lifted her suspension and fired her. John received a message that Pierce has been found nearby. Where? On the fundamenta. But on arrival, the police have detained an Englishman, who says he's only a tourist being paid to follow instructions and he's not Pierce. Elise tells Frank that she loves him, but she also loves Pierce. I may have a solution for you. Frank opened the safe by entering the correct code, revealing that he was Alexander Pierce all along. When the police come back and open the safe with explosive, they found a check for 745 million. John wants to keep pursuing Pierce, but since the taxes are paid, the case is closed. Then Alexander and Elise sail away together. Thank you for watching this far. Subscribe for more videos like this, and see you next video.